I recently published a video on how you can auto adjust the column width as you enter more character on your particular column itself. But someone had a question if I can apply this same kind of feature for the entire workbook, not just one worksheet itself. Well, this is how you do it. First, you're going to right click off any of this cell here and from the context menu, you're going to select view code. In here, you're going to double click on this workbook like this. Make sure you're working on this workbook and then you press Ctrl V to paste this VBA script. If you would like a copy of this VBA script, do leave a request on the comment section of this video. Let me give you an overview of what this particular VBA script does. The first statement here basically disable any events. Let's say for example, if you're trapping a uh, selection change or cell change on your VBA, this basically disables it and allows this VBA script to run accordingly. And this section here prevents any calculation uh, to automatically calculate so everything is done manually but these two flags are turned on as soon as all this main section of the subroutine is completed now looking at the main subroutine uh, WS is basically a worksheet uh, variable definition and this for loop what it does is that it goes through every single sheet on this workbook and then basically if that particular workbook on the for loop matches what you have been modifying it then that cell will do an auto field uh, rather the column width adjustment using this statement here but if you want all the worksheet on this workbook to be affected basically what you do is you get rid of this two statement here and you'll affect all the worksheet here let me show you what i mean by that so we'll start off with working on only the active worksheet so that it affects that particular worksheet here so i'm going to press ctrl s to save and then close your VBA editor here. Now, if you were to enter, let's say, a different column like that, you can see that the column width auto adjusts by itself. Let me show you one more time here again. You can see that the column width automatically adjusts. Also works on if you enter the entry on your actual data set itself. Now, you can see that if you go back to this guy here and you adjust this and squeeze this thing here, and you go back to this one here. I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and delete these two column because this two was not required. And basically changes to uh, something very big here. Maybe you can see that I, I've made changes to this particular column width, but if you look at the previous worksheet, this thing is not affected at all. Let's go back to our VBA editor here and then go view code and go this one here. Now, like I said, if you were to remove this two uh, code like that, now this will affect the entire workbook regardless of whatever sheet or whatever cell values you make changes to any sheet here. Like for example, you can see this is still crushed in together. But if I were to change this to say something very large, of course, this particular sheet it adjusts the column width. But if you go back to the previous one, you can see that the column width has also been adjusted.